Ladies and gentlemen, we have detected gravitational waves. We did it. In the fabric of space time, ripples in space time, if you will. The gravitational wave. So these gravitational waves were produced by two colliding black holes that came together, merged to form a single black hole about 1.3 billion years ago. They were detected by LIGO, the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory. LIGO is the most precise measuring device ever built. Hey, this is not a Hollywood production that I'm going to show you. It is actually a real computer. Let me start with what we saw. So on September 14th, 2015, the two LIGO observatories in Hanford, Washington and Livingston, Louisiana recorded a signal nearly at the same time, nearly simultaneously, and the signal had a very specific characteristic. The characteristic of as time went forward, the frequency went up. And what was amazing about this signal is that it's exactly what you would expect, what Einstein's theory of general relativity would predict for two big massive objects like black holes in spiraling and merging together. They're spinning around. You see the, the, they're getting closer and closer together as they get closer and closer together. But I do want to say something else. This, this is not just about the detection of gravitational waves. That's the story today. But what's really exciting is what comes next. Right, it's 400 years ago, Galileo turned a telescope to the sky and opened the era of modern observational astronomy. I think we're doing something equally important here today. I think we're opening a window on the universe, the window of gravitational wave astronomy. For 1.3 billion years, it passes through everything. It goes right through matter, right through.